Munich is considered Germany's most livable city. While packed with history, it's also this country's Hollywood and Silicon Valley all rolled into one. This city celebrates its traditions with gusto, and at the same time, it remains a modern cultural force. Marienplatz, or Mary Square, marks the old center. The neo-Gothic New City Hall, or Neues Rathaus, is only about 100 years old. It dominates the square. This inviting town square is now Munich's living room. The Glockenspiel performs at the top of the hour, as the Bavarian royal couple, celebrating their wedding day, oversees a joust. Bavaria always wins. And the Coopers do their jig. Virtually all you see was bombed flat in World War II and rebuilt since. After the war, Germany's destroyed cities debated how they'd rebuild. They could reconstruct their old centers or bulldoze and start over from scratch. While Frankfurt voted to go modern, and today it's nicknamed Germany's Manhattan, the people of Munich decided to rebuild their old center. Buildings cannot exceed the height of the church spires. Today, Munich's downtown is vital. People come here, rather than to suburban malls, to do their shopping. Munich's main drag is one of Europe's original great pedestrian zones. Local business people were enraged in 1972 when cars were first prohibited. But now, with 9,000 shoppers passing their display windows each hour, shopkeepers are happy. Imagine this street in hometown USA. I'm being joined by my friend and Munich guide, George Reichelmeier. So it's Reichelmeier. 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 So you know, Bavaria, the state, uh, is a very conservative part of Germany. But München, the capital, is different. It's a very liberal city. One of the ideas of the council is to keep the traffic outside. And that makes downtown München a very silent place. Uh, it's quiet over here. You have green areas uh, always and a good public transportation system. So leave your car outside. You can still feel small town Munich here at the Victorian Market, long a favorite with locals for fresh produce and friendly service. While this most expensive real estate in town would have been overrun by fast food places, Munich keeps the rent low so these old time shops can carry on. The Victorian Market's beer garden taps you into great budget eating. Stalls sell the best first, sandwiches, produce, and much more. All six of Munich's breweries enjoy a share of the business. At the beer counter, a sign which changes every day or two announces which of the beers is being served. Today's beer is Paulaner. Beer gardens like this go back to the days when breweries stored their beer in cellars under courtyards kept cool by the shade of bushy chestnut trees. With the inviting shade and all that cool beer so handy, it was only natural that tables were set up and these convivial eateries evolved. 